So guys, if you want amazing grips and cases for your controllers, don't forget to go to fadesgrips.store and don't forget to use Undead for a cheeky little discount. Fade Grips, get a grip of your game. Hi guys, what is up? Undead Gaming here, back with another career mode. I know it's been a while, I apologise, but we're here now and... Yeah, hopefully the gameplay is not too bad. Um, I've been doing a few bits on Modern Warfare here and there. I've been streaming, I've been doing this and that. Um, but yeah, obviously I've got to make sure I get my career mode out to you guys. <coughs> so we are playing Exeter in the next game of the season. Um, we're going to start with Dallas and Bruce Stark. We're going to stick that Diaz on the wing, Hall on the wing, Rolls and Crothers. Ward and Darling in the middle, Jones and Noyle in the back. Uh, we will bring Nibs on um, for Dallas throughout the game. So, without any further ado, guys, we are currently three points ahead in the table. So, without any further ado, let's get into the game. The top scorer. Stay on that. And it's live. What a perfect day for football we've got here. Martin Tyler here, along with Alan Smith. Our competition today is EFL League 2. This should be a special game, Alan. That's a great start. Should be a good one. A lot of talk about the tactics these two managers are likely to employ beforehand. We'll soon find out. A good vision. It's a great start. Look at that. Liam Bruce to win. Fourth minute goal, that is absolutely sensational, guys. Look at that. Brothers is through. Can he make it stay? That's a sick goal, but it is offside, unfortunately. It's no goal. The flag's up. It's certainly a, a well worked move, but uh, denied by the. the here. Good save by Callum Good Burton save. there. In goes the corner. Well, the ball's gone out for a goal kick. He could take them on here. Probing with the pass. That's not offside. offside. That was not offside at all. That could open them up. Oh, that's seconds. Ah, offside. He's got the flag up. It's offside. Come on, one more. Two Just minutes of added time. That's what it says on the board. Right, and that is half time, and we are 1 0 right, up, guys. It's a good start to this game. Um, hopefully, we can bring some more goals into the second half. Hampton Town, 47 minutes, please. That was a quality Thanks, ball. Alan. And he gets onto it. Can he shoot? He does shoot, and that's a cracking goal there. Goal. Brings it down with his right left, volleys, half volleys with his this. left, and that is straight into the, the back of the net. What do we say? We said we would get more, we're going to get more. Well, Tino up, beautiful. Straight at the keeper the there. The Diaz is gone. Good vision. Oh, we couldn't quite. Oh, we do we get it? And oh, there we go. We do manage to get that home. Jack Rolls with the goal. Lucky goal there, but a goal nonetheless. He's got skill with the ball, backing himself in these circumstances. Ah, we have a chance again to play Jack Rolls through, but just intercepted this time. Don't get it back. Shoot! Oh, that's an absolute well rocket by O'Neill. That was a good save by Ward in net. And we do take the corner with Paul. Can we get in something on it? We do. We do, but we can't get it in the net. Oh. Closing him down. As another shot. Oh, shot. and that one was another rocket, and that was nearly in again. Corner, Cambridge United. Corner's going to be taken short this time. 
No, that's not how you do it, guys. Two, two. Great to have Alan McAnally out and about for us. That's how you do it. 4 0. Cracking header by Jack Rose. Is that Jack Rose? That has to be Jack Rose. No. Nibs in. Sorry, late substitute. Nibs in with a the header really. there. Just playing for Quality pride cross. There. Really being torn apart. That's a great cross, but very straightforward piece of goalkeeping as he catches the cross. There we go, guys. Four 0 We win that game, and that was an absolute cracking game. We do beat Exeter there, and hopefully that puts us further in front in the league table. We're not doing the conference. But, let's have a look how we're doing. Okay, so we are currently five points in the league. Luke Cannon saying he needs to play more often. We can snatch him in. You still have your place in the squad. Don't worry. So our next game is of course against Grimsby Town, who is in top six. Taft says he's in good form and that he wants to play. Um, I'll consider it. I will probably put him in for Ward, to be fair. Reggie Lamb did play well, but we will keep it as it is for now, because it's working. It is working. Monthly scouting update. So I potential I'm not I'm gonna reject everyone who's below eighty one. He looks good. Sign him. Reject. We've got eight one, eight six and eight four. What we're gonna do? We're gonna scout these two further. Great job with our youth program, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, we're close to doing that one. So guys, here we go. Let's get into the next game against Grimsby Town. And let's hope we can bag another win, guys could get hold of this ball and ask all the questions we could be in we tend to get a lot of early goals at the moment we just scored in a fourth minute Jenny Dallas in front at the moment Cambridge United still searching for an equaliser there's some good quick hit the ball out well played Jones and Rob Hall's in there to get out clearance. as well for others clever ball and now Brewster is absolutely through. Can he power at home? Oh, he hits the crossbar. Rob Paul manages to track it back in. And that tackle has got it all on the turnover to go for the throw. Brewster's just they've done it running, absolutely really powering through him. Can he do it? And that is how you do it. An absolute special one there by Liam Brewster. Jockeys the goalie. The goalie thinks he's going to shoot. Goes back in his net and he cuts inside and shoots. Beautiful goal. Well, it's a fine individual counter. There we go. We are two up at half, half time. time. That's a very good start again to the game. Um, let's hope we can carry this on into the second half and increase our lead and increase our lead on the league. It could take them on here. Oh, sorry, I was concentrating there. I wasn't really concentrating. I was just literally just concentrating, trying to get something from that. Hendrick. Rose. And that's a foul. Oh, referee. That is not a yellow card. Easy decision for this referee. There's. Could get away here. Dallas there hits the post, goes back towards him, he gets the ball, he crosses it in, Nibsy, not Nibsy, Brewster can't quite get there. Liam O'Neill coming on for Carruthers. And they are going to try and cross this one in. 
Right there. Go on, get it in the box. What is happening here? They can't, they can't get it out properly and we can't attack it properly. There we go guys, the game does end 2-0, it was a pretty, pretty tame second half, we've done what we need to do in the first half, we'll take that, and it is time for the last game of the episode, unfortunately. And we are playing against Northampton, we're going to stop play so we can do some uh, training so we've got Diaz on now in there hopefully we can get him going up a little bit more Darling's going up very well he's 60 rated after this game, next episode we do have Barnsley in a round of the cup. I don't know what cup it is though, without checking. Anyway guys, here we are, we're going into the next game against Northampton Town and hopefully we can snatch another beautiful win. It's Cambridge United. Yeah, thanks as always Derek, it's a pleasure so to be here. Very good at a really good game today, the atmosphere is great. We do manage to give the ball straight away there. Off. What is going on? We won't be disappointed. The initial eleven today for the hosts. Oh, Jack rolls foul there in the middle of the park, well, and their an captain is going to get a yellow card. Chris Lines. Dallas is through. Manages to prove all it. No, he doesn't. Yes, he does, and that's a goal. Surely, what is Jack Rolls doing in that position? Oh, what is he doing? That was just a simple pass away. Again, surely. Oh, my dear aunt. We're getting the chances. We just can't put them away. Dallas can shoot. Dallas can score. Get in there. Come on. That's what we like to see, ladies and gentlemen. Beautiful goal there. Just running past the defence. Well, they say there's no better time to score just before half time. The team talk of both sides are going to be Strikes changing. Strikes the ball home. It's a good Bottom finish, Derek, and they out. deserve the lead. Just One before half time. Then. There we go, that really was just that before half time. Um, so, as you can here. see, we are 1 0 up at half time. Going into the second half, and let's hope we can hold it or even get another goal. Through boosters away, this is going to be a goal surely. This is what I wanted to do last time. Bang, fake shot, put it straight to the bottom net, and that's what we call leading from the front. He's managed to lose his marker. I believe there's been a goal in one of the other matches. That's offside. That is offside. 74 minutes played. 1-1. Alan McAdally keeping us right up to date. And it's a matter of what occurs in the final 15 minutes. Beautifully weighted ball. Can he put it away? Doesn't need to. Oh no! Oh no! Oh, I threw there. That's a strike. Goal of course. Game over, 4 0, 88th minute. And uh, guys, that is the end of the game. And we did manage to win that 4 0. Is it 4 0? I think it was 4 0. Bad by me. Yeah, 4 0. And obviously, we're not doing an interview. Anyway, guys, this has been the end of the episode. Um, if you want to see more episodes, then. I'll give you more episodes. If you want to see other things from me, just comment down below um, what other things you want to see. And um, obviously, don't forget to smash that subscribe button, smash that like button, as always, turn the bell notification on so you know what I'm doing. Don't forget to go to fadegrips.store and use code UNDEAD for a lovely little discount. Thank you for watching. Peace!